Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So, we had quite an event. We start, uh, we tried to fire up the car. I bled the coolant. Um, and uh, we tried to fire up the car and we had some issues. So I'll show you a little bit what happened. Let me unplug this. So I'll give you guys a little update. So I warmed up the oil. I plugged it in the wall for a bit so it should be warmed up I have to prime it so let's uh, let me put this down I'll prime it that way when we start it up it's all primed Yeah, so I basically put, I put a drill on that little uh, Peterson there, give it a few turns, and uh, it primes itself. It's got fuel, I did the coolant earlier today, it's all primed. Uh, why is this not plugged in here? Exhaust back pressure. Cool. Uh, I want to see oil pressure. Ready? Yeah, this uh, trying to trying to move the cam to the back because I had it in the wrong spot. All these damn injectors in the way here. It's hard to maneuver this stuff, but the plate's almost out. Thanks. No light. Oh, okay. It's kind of dark. Okay. Ready? Everything plugged in?
rich for super some reason. Rich. Yeah, super yeah, rich, it's yeah. running really rich. I wonder why. <sighs> it's running. So yeah, so uh, it ran good. It's running a little rich actually. I gotta figure out why, but it always ran like that on pump gas. So here it is. It's all pretty much ready to go. Um, I cut the, the two pieces here, the intake for the hood. And uh, this I'm gonna have to trim. I'm probably gonna leave maybe an inch or so. So I have to trim that. But it's all done. Ooh, dirty. I gotta clean it up. Yeah, so it's pretty much done. I'm gonna have to redo that intercooler pipe. We're probably gonna gonna notch the uh, the fuel tank. Uh, there was one thing that didn't fit. Oh, the wastegate screamer pipes didn't fit. So that's an easy fix. So I'm gonna go to Renee and fix those things. But yeah, she's ready to roll. So there you go. So for those who uh, follow the series, thanks guys. So subscribe, hit us a like, and uh, let's go racing. The track is still closed because it is COVID stuff. So we're waiting for the tracks to open. Hopefully uh, by May 22nd, it's saying it's going to open. So we'll see if that's going to work or not. So stay tuned. Let us know what you think. Future videos. Maybe I'll post something about this one here, the blue one. But uh, thanks, guys. Take care.